We haven't seen many pictures like these this year in Colorado, and that's a good thing. And we didn't have that predicted fire season yet and hopefully that continues. After a historically devastating year for wildfires in 2020, reports predicted 2021 could be just as bad. So far, we've mainly only seen smaller fires like the one burning Monday night in Summit County. Small wildfires can turn big and be devastating. Einar Jensen is a risk reduction specialist for South Metro Fire Rescue. Of all the factors that contribute to determining how bad a wildfire can be on any year, the most important can be controlled by all of us. Personal choices, personal responsibility are always the most essential factor when it comes to not just preventing wildfires, but also mitigating the severity of those wildfires when they do occur. While it looks like people this year have made good choices, some of the largest fires that burned last year are believed to be caused by humans, though the exact causes haven't been determined. They also started spreading in the fall around this time last year. The Cameron Peak fire ignited in August, but didn't grow to become the largest fire in the history of the state until September and October. Same with the East Troublesome fire, which burned into the record books in October. It comes back to human choices. If we, the residents and visitors to Colorado, are making good choices this fall, we should come through this okay this year. When a fire does start, it helps to have the resources to fight it. With fewer fires to fight in the state this year, they've been able to attack new blazes quickly. All factors that help the state stay safe. In Denver, I'm Mark Salinger, 9 News. Drought conditions have also improved in much of the state since last year, though parts of western Colorado have still seen very little rain.